What's happening, everybody? Y'all know what time it is. Yep. It's my lawn time, eh? And uh, today, we're actually looking at our squash. And uh, it's looking all right. You know what I mean? It is coming off of the same container as the okra plants are in. But uh want to show y'all this beautiful thing here. Yep. We got us a nice look looking fruit. Downside is we don't have any other flowers to pollinate it with. Uh there's another upcoming one right there. So I'm gonna try to pollinate that thing with a cucumber flower. I don't know if it's going to work, y'all, but, hey, first time for everything. Going to find out. You know what I mean? Now, we do have some cucumbers here. Uh, that's some right there. I'm going to go ahead and uh, probably pick this one right here. We're gonna pick this one, y'all. To pollinate this uh to pollinate the flower with. Can't get it all up in there. We got some giant mosquitoes out here. Let me set y'all down right quick. I need to, I need to remove these petals. All right, my bad, y'all. I'm back. So, I got the middle of the flower in my hand. We're going to have some squash tasting cucumber. Oh, man. We just going to leave it in there. It's out in there, y'all. There it is. So, I keep y'all posted and updated. Uh, shoot another video whenever, you know, we'll see some progress or, or whatnot. Look at that okra flower that just fell down this morning. Then I tell y'all, these squash was running. And wherever they're running, I hope they bring back some squash. What? <laughs> All praise to the Most High, yo. Yep. Looks like there's a couple more right there. Hopefully they do turn out. But let's just check it out. That's a big one. Yeah. Just need some pollinators. You know what I mean? So what we're going to do is we're going to get some more cucumber flowers. Yeah. That's what we're going to do. Get some more cucumber flowers and try to hand pollinate these bad boys. Yeah, that one, 
That one hopefully works. Gotta make sure. Ain't no. Alright, y'all know the routine. I gotta put y'all down, man. Let me see if I can prop y'all up. Let's see what's up. Tomato, tomato plan to help us out. Oh, snap. Alright. So I'm just exposing the center of the flower. Like so, and y'all could actually eat this flour. Man, y'all gonna be amazed what it tastes like. And I know some of y'all out there probably thinking this dude is weird. He shouldn't be doing this. Tell y'all a secret. Y'all should tell the bees the same thing. When they hop from flower to flower, pollinating different plants with the different pollens they carry. Yep. So, we're going to leave that in there. I'll be right back. I'm going to try to go get another one. Got another flower, y'all. The, the, these are cucumber flowers right here. These small, these small ones. So, just carefully split it I normally grab the bottom and just try to be careful with it and you just want that little that little centerpiece you can get this to the chicken eat it yourself or throw it away Shake it like that, and you know, go leafing away. Now, I don't know if y'all noticed, but like the squash, the cucumber, and the watermelon are practically all, you know, similar. So, hey. I'm going to let y'all know if this thing works or not. You know what I mean? Like, for real, for real. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Spin y'all around. All right. Kind of damaged the pedals. It's all right. So, stay tuned, y'all. Anyway, appreciate y'all tuning in. Remember, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. Don't forget to lock down that notification bell and share these videos if y'all know somebody that might be interested in it. Know what I mean? On that note, remember, you can do it too. Till next time.